Hey you guys, the Kid Gaming here. Today we are playing uh, ESPN Fantasy Basketball Draft. So right now, what we are doing is we are in the middle of a draft lottery right now. So this is actually pretty cool. I've just been doing this, and it's very fun. So what I got so far, I apologize. Actually, I did start from the beginning, but it didn't go so well. So well, the footage actually got. All right, guys, we are back. I just realized that I can do something pretty cool with um the the software that I'm using. I can actually pause like the actual footage, so it's part of like cutting and trimming or splitting other clips. So instead of doing that, I can just pause the video anytime I want. So literally, so I won't have you guys just like waiting or just hear me rambling the whole time. All right, there we go. It's my pick. So what I need is I need an elite um point guard, or I should either go with a point guard or a center. You know, I'm just gonna. Are you serious, bro? They drafted Kyrie already. Are you serious? Okay, now I'm mad. <laughs> they got me there. Now I'm mad. Alright, I'll either go with Mo Money Williams or Derrick Rose. Let's go with Derrick Rose. I'll give Mo Money Williams another chance. Alright, that disappoints me a little bit. Uh, I was looking to draft Kyrie, but you know it's all good. So let's see um, like who else, who everyone else does have. Well, everyone else has a fire line. Oh, I'm 7th. Uh, for some reason, 41 points. I never really understood what the point system means. I mean, my lineup seems pretty far. Chicago Bulls been doing good. Can I? Okay, they already got Pau Gasol. Might want to keep it. Um, Cavs Bulls right here. So, who can I draft? All right, let's see. Um, let's switch this switches to all. So who? Okay, Chris Bosh. Chris Bosh. If I can steal Chris Bosh, that would be amazing. If I can steal Chris Bosh. Alright, okay. Chris Bosh. DeAndre Jordan. Let's go. That's fire right there. That is fire. Okay. Chris Bosh. Alright, so let me just um get the people so I won't forget. So we have Dirk, Timmy D, D Wade, DeMar DeRozan. Um, let's see. Isaiah Thomas, we'll put him on. Carl Anthony Towns, Andrew Wiggins, maybe, um, who else did I say? Oh, Bradley Beal, I saw him somewhere. I'll get him, I'll see if I can go back. DeAndre. Oh, shoot. Wait, oh, forget it. I had to drag it in my bag, guys. I'm just, like, cl clicking random things. But let's just, um, drag him here. Actually, I'm looking to get a D Wade to put on the bench because honestly, I, I okay. My turn. Who did everyone else draft? All right, Reggie Jackson, Kyle Lowry, Marcus Saw. All right, so I'm pretty set up. I'm set up right here. So who I want? I need a power forward. So let's go with um Chris Bosh himself. Let's just look up Bosh so we can just get it right there. Alright, so we drafted Chris Bosch. Do you know how elite Chris Bosch is? You know what? People, like, I don't know. Chris Bosch is, like, one of the best players. One well, of the best power forwards in the NBA right now. Because you have your Kevin Love, your Blake Griffin. Zach Randolph isn't doing too good. And then you have maybe Kevin Durant Mello, but... I consider them as um small forwards, especially on how Melo plays small forwards because Porzingis plays power and Robin Lopez play, plays center and Kevin Durant and his Cantor play center. Um, I think hmm, I, I think Stephen Adams is in the starting lineup. I'm not even sure, but if Kevin Durant plays power forward, that's really small. Well, comparing to some teams, they have like seven footers in. They have seven footers in starting lineups. The Knicks are doing it with Porzingis, and the Bulls are doing it with um Pau Gasol. So that's a very interesting thing that you that you do. So we're we're just waiting for my 46 pick, and I'll see you then.
Alright guys, we are back. I'm actually pretty mad that they stole my pick for center. They took DeAndre Jordan. I mean, Brooke, Brooke, Brooke Lopez was an option, but he's not really the best. Alright. Hopefully... Okay. They choose Pau Casal yet. Okay, yes they do. Alright. I need somebody quick and fast. All right, who should we get? They already, they, they already chose. Okay, we can get Dirk or Tim Duncan. All right, think about it. All right, you know what? Let's just get Timmy D. Actually, no, Tim D uh, Dirk. There we go. Oh no, are you serious? I want um, I want Dirk as my center. Okay, apparently I need a real center, but who am I supposed to get? So right now guys, let's uh organize this right here. Oh, uh, I need to go to players. Alright, so there we go. Alright, so they took all the good centers. Jonas Valanciunas, am I seriously going to be stuck with him? Oh, Dwight Howard. Dwight Howard, I can grab him. That would be a nice save. If I can get Dwight Howard, maybe in his cancer. If may, may, maybe I can even grab a Tyson Chandler. Who, who knows, guys? But I'll see you when we reach that 55th pick. Alright guys, so we have a pick. So no one chose my pick, so I'm gonna have to choose um Dwight Howard here. So let's um grab him. Alright, let's draft him. So right now guys, fire lineup right here. This is pretty fire. We have Derek Rose, Jimmy Butler, LeBron, Chris Bosch, and um D Dwight Howard. Alright, did anyone grab D Wade? If no one grabbed the way to up, oh wait, did they? Hmm. Did they? That's, that's my quote. Oh, they already dropped the Andrew Wiggins. That sucks. Alright, I don't think they drafted D Wade. The sad thing is, we're only up to the 55th pick. It's pretty crazy. But, yeah, I don't, I don't think so, guys. So right now, if they didn't, we're going to grab D-Wade. Alright, let's look for uh, another elite shooting guard. I don't want to look for a small forward yet. But let's just see, guys. So Stephen Curry, he's more of a point guard, but if you want to consider him as a shooting, go ahead. So we have Gordon Dragage right here. I can really use this guy because in 2K, he is fire. And I know, like, if you're good in 2K, like, if anybody can use you in 2K, like, for example, Seven Curry, anyone should be able to use him in 2K. But if you can't, that, that's kind of sad. But, I don't know, I don't even know what to say about that. Alright, so, okay, D-Way did not get chosen, that's nice. Alright, so we have Gerald Smith, Kyle Korver. We, we can grab Kobe, but Kobe is not, like, oh, we can get DeMar DeRozan. Alright, so let's put down our, like, our pick list. Alright, guys, so right now, I'm just looking at the picks to see what's going on. So, I can easily just grab a D-Wade right here. I can fill in my guard spot. So, right now, let me check out the standings. I'm pretty sure I'm last. Alright, I'm second to last. So, okay, <laughs> last now. Okay, nice. But, honestly, guys, I don't really understand... Like, how you get the points and stuff, like, it's, like, the best players, because apparently Team H has the best players for doing it like that, because, honestly, he does not have the best players. Derek Favors, Gordon Dragic, LaMarcus Aldridge, Anthony Davis, Nicholas Batoon, Montez, the only nice players are there is Kyrie, LaMarcus, and Anthony Davis. Gordon Dragic, too. But, come on, like... I don't really, like, is it because what they're averaging in the, the real game? Because I would think that 
LeBron, Jimmy Butler, Derrick Rose, Chris Bosh, Dwight. I, th I would think those guys are, like, doing, like, good stuff. But not to get me wrong, you have people who have, like, Russell Westbrook, Kawhi Leonard, and Paul Gasol. Like, they're doing good. We have him with KD, DeMar DeRozan, and Victor Oladipo. So, pretty nice lineup. So, we have a 75th pick. So, this actually goes on and on. But, honestly, guys, I enjoyed this. So, yeah, I'll see you guys with the 75th pick. Wait. Pool, who are they drafting? Oh, wait. I can go up. Alright, honestly, guys, I, I, I think I can find a sleeper pick. So right now, Ty Lawson, Ryan Anderson, Marquise Morris. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure I can find somebody. Alright, guys, so we are back. So, let's see who are we going to choose. I think we should go with, um, let's see who we got in our squad. So, we have three big men. Yes, Bosch, Dwight Howard, and Dirk Nowinski. So let's see, let's see if we can grab a small forward. Maybe we can grab someone. Okay, Chandler Parsons, we don't really want him. Danny Green, he's more of a shooting guard to me, honestly. Jabari Parker, he's a he's he's a good um pick. Justice Winslow. I know he can cook. Alright, let's get Andre Gidala. Cause I he's uh the finals MVP, so we have to grab him. We have to grab him. So honestly, it actually went very quick, guys. I'm actually watching YouTube right now just to stall some time. I'm not just staring at the screen like a loser. I don't know what these guys are doing. But for right now, I want to see like if we can grab somebody. Okay. Like maybe we can get like a Jarrell Green. I think that would be a, a nice pick that we can get. So I want to see if I can search players. Let's see if we can get a Jarrell Green. Or, or just look up green. Alright, so Danny Green, okay. I was actually going to see if there was like a Draymond Green. But, you know, it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. So I'm surprised he's 576, but Danny Green's 50th. Like, really? But Danny Green's alright. He's not the best. But he's alright. I mean, he's, he's cool. But, so, we're most likely going to get, um, Jarrell Green. Maybe we can get a Paul Pierce. Uh, I, I don't know. But, we'll see, guys. Alright, guys, so, I was going to get, a uh, Jarrell Green. But then I realized we kind of need, like, a big man, big guy on our squad. So, let's, uh, let's see, like, who we can get. Let's look at Power 4 real fast. G Draymond Green already been taken. I'm, I'm a little disappointed about that, but it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. So David Lee, I don't really want David Lee. So Jabari Parker, like I said, uh, okay, let's get him Josh Smith. Is it Przingis or Josh Smith? Actually, you know what? I have faith in Przingis. Let's let's get Przingis. Let's go. I have faith in him. We'll get Przingis. He's seven foot. I don't know. I consider him more as a center, but they um they feel that he's a power for it because he's a stretch four. He can he's, he can shoot threes. So all right, guys. So let's um let's just grab Jarrell Green right here, just to make it quick. But all right. So all my people that I was like I want to grab, they're already taken. So let's just grab a Jarrell Green right here, and I'm not even sure who we're gonna choose for our next pick. Alright guys, so right now, I'm most likely going to grab Tristan Thompson right here. Just going to see, like, any other picks. So right now, before I even pick him, Tristan Thompson up, I want to see if Joe Johnson's available. Okay, Joe Johnson's not available. Right, that's, that's a little disappointing, but we can still grab Tristan Thompson real fast. So yeah, um, oh wow, we're up to the 115th pick. How? I don't, I'm not even sure how many rounds this goes to. Alright, anyway guys, thanks for watching. This has been a good video.
I'm actually very excited for like more content like this. So hopefully you guys can stick around. This is actually the final day of the, the draft. The video is gonna cut off on me. So be sure to like, subscribe, and definitely leave a comment. I got Manu Ginobili.